fucking god. That's exactly what it is. You need to get burned on the other side. Remember all the examinations we gave you? All the tests we made? They showed how sick you really were. Because he was violated in there. And if he could get his attack rope into the hole, he'll go down. Stay away from there. He doesn't like men. Stay away from there. Suspicious shadows in your lungs. And in your sputum, germs. TB journey. That was all of those all bad. Our sanatorium is but one of the many base hospitals of a great warfare. The sanatorium is a place to care for sick people and restore them to a useful life. This hospital, sitting in the heart of Ohio, was built in 1911 to deal with the tuberculosis outbreak. It originally held 24 beds. During the peak of the TB epidemic in 1927, it was renovated to hold 158 beds. By 1970, it was nearly empty. After losing its funding, it closed its doors in 1973. Today, it sits forgotten in the middle of the woods in Ohio. So we're making our way. Um, we just walked down this big, long path. You can see the hospital back in the background. All right, so we're just getting to uh, the entrance. Wow, this crazy fucking hospital. It looks like there's some fire damage, but we have a lot. This thing is closed in the uh, 73 TB hospital, also considered uh, the Ohio Isolation Ward. Looks like it's pretty fucking run down. We're uh, just going to keep going. And this place is completely dilapidated. There's no safe way to be inside of there. place is collapsing and the steel beams are bent. So we're still kind of scoping out the place. We're going to find a way in. That looks almost like a place in. However, it also looks pretty dangerous. Part of me feels freaked out about going inside. Like, what? Like even just putting my... No, I'm going in. I just feel like what? I might get touched. This lone smokestack is all that remains of the former heating plant building. Right nearby, we found the twisted remains of various medical equipment. You know, if you ever felt a feeling of doom, you can feel it here, I'll tell you that. Let's see how far we drop that is. Uh, we're gonna need a light. So, we could definitely get in there if we wanted to. Oh, well, 
something that's insulated. Oh god. Oh my fucking god. That's exactly what it is. So this is the other side. That's where we were looking in. Ooh, God. Pussy. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm feeling like right now. A big old pussy. <sighs> Die, pussy. Oh, that does not fucking ride well with me. Okay, so this is where we were looking in below. Okay. Every direction. I don't know which way they're going. Sorry. No, I should take pictures. You should take some. Okay, look here we got outside. And here comes the rain. Still some kind of bad well, it's a hospital, so you know it's to restart. That's what the bathroom is. Yeah, it's got that. Here's the bathrooms. This place isn't doing so good. The floor feels like. Ugh. Well, it's also got this weird spongy feel to it that's just freaking me the fuck out. Okay. Very old. You can see the cloth. Well, I bet we're about ready to get rained on. So this is the, yeah, we could just did a circle. It is. Everywhere you go, you think it's like a closet that just goes on with the more hole with. Oh, the fuck? Elevator. Threw everything down there. That it would be an elevator. We, this is not the, the best idea. Cause it, like, it looks like this. Oh my god, look at that. Can you see it? I think we need to go to the stairs. Okay, once we get up the ground floor, make sure. These are old hospital rooms, look, the old bathroom. Should have been the bathroom. Should have been the Did you just hear that? That was loud, that was a loud bang. We're in the TV hospital. Is there someone in here? There's a good thumb bang. Look at the car here. Oh, what's that? Yeah. <laughs> Weird, there's like dripping water sounds in there. Well, that's where you were hearing all that fucking noises and shit. Actually, really actually, 
Where the fuck did we hear that fucking bang from? Because it came from over here. From over here. So maybe this is like the like administrative yeah. room. She's good to pay attention to. What is that? So I think this was probably like maybe the nurses ward or something. Oh, well, nurse station. Or, yeah. Yeah, that's quite. That would make sense. I think the hallway. She's good to hear. That's weird. What the hell? It's like a weird locker closet. It was a locker without the doors on it, but it's a small room. That's weird. Maybe there's a bar. Maybe this is like a little dining room, kitchen area. So what the fuck is up with this cage? It's a little Legos guy. Uh, did you hear that? I couldn't figure out where it came from. Um, somewhere back in there. Look at that fucking pathway with the broken cement. Doesn't look There's a lot of water. Oh wow! So I'll bet you that's probably what we were hearing. Maybe not this particular spot, but. Exactly opposite. This is the room you were talking about. N yeah. Uh, this was, well, well, this was the one that room. said. Um, what did it say on the outside there? Danny Shin fingered his sister. Get fuck. Get fuck. Got them. That's the room right here. Ugh. I'm gonna go over there. Go for it. There's kicking balls in the fucking wall. You're good. <laughs> As if that would make you so this is like a giant shower room. You have to sit people in one shower, right? Yeah, I don't know why you need this large of a shower. The rain is settling in, man. It's crazy. Like, I mean, it's like, why did they just smash holes in all the walls? Oh, fuck. Holy shit. That's fucking asbestos right there, right? We learned that at some point in the past, local paintball enthusiasts plan to make the hospital a paintball arena. They were allowed to come in and remove the remaining medical equipment, and also put holes in the walls. We also learned that one other building was still standing, sort of, the bathhouse for the employees. We didn't make it to that part of the property, but based on the imagery, it appears as if that building is almost completely collapsed. Um, it's insulated. That's where they call it out. Why is it insulated? <laughs> Another tiny room. Tiny room. I think it's room. I don't know what time we're going to go. 
Sigmatic LSD. Ooh, crazy. Look, that's what they look like after they took their LSD. I know, there's their little Saturn. Huh? Oh, God, you can smell that. That is not this water. Oh, it's black mold. Something not good, yeah. What do you think, bathroom? Non gents. What's that mean? That's the women's? Why would they graffiti fucking tell us what bathroom that is? That's not a bathroom. What the yeah, fuck is it? plumbing in there. What would that do? Just like two closets or something? Maybe. Ah. Oh, ah. Uh, is this a... This is like a different hallway. Why do we have two hallways? I don't know. Two hallways right next yeah, to Yeah, I don't like this hallway. I like the other one better. Two hallways right next to each other. I wish you could... Well, okay, so this, I think, is where the stairs are, right here. Am I right? Nope, I'm wrong. That's okay. Um. Why are there two hallways right next to each other? I don't know if I trust those. Okay. Two. Wait, what? Uh. Okay. Oh, my God. I don't... Ugh. Uh. Did you just feel that? This is an elevator, isn't it? Thank God, I don't like it up here. You feel it? Yeah. It's like, I'd rather hang out downstairs for fucking... Yeah, it's definitely like, the air is actually worse up here, I think. Yeah, you know, we're not doing <laughs> smells like urine up here. You get that? It smells like fucking piss. Go ahead. Shit. <laughs> I'm gonna look forward to not smelling this smell anymore. Oh. Look at the drain. Yeah, right. It's fucking cool looking up there, though. Yeah, it's actually. This is generally, this is where all the power. Later, after hearing from the locals about how creepy this place was in the nighttime, we decided to go back at night and put one of the ITW crew in the body cooler for the entire evening. Is it a cooler or is it an incinerator? My vote's for an incinerator. Okay, the concussion girl's gonna crawl in there. Alright, I'm here. So people, this is the last stop on their um this is their last stop on their tour in this TV hospital. 
was in here. This is, I'm guessing where they either burned the bodies or cooled the bodies. But looking at the fixtures, I'm going to go with, this was a cooler. This is where they stored that dead body. I know Jordan sucks for dick life. When your hospital has no more patients to treat, your doctors, your nurses have moved on. That hospital is left to inherit the wasteland. If you want to learn more about the history of this place, including photo galleries, documents, and everything else, visit the episode page at itw.crustlandia.com.